Welcome back to Skyrim for Seniors. And here we are out in front of Kronvanger Hall. <clears throat> I wonder why in the world it's called Hall. There has to be a backstory to that one as opposed to Kronvanger Cave. <clears throat> a Kronvanger lair or something. Um, we're here as an animal extermination quest given to us by Ella of the Companions. Now, just before we went in there, we, or stopped the last episode, we went down and found a place called Mixwater Mill. And I've forgotten the young lady's uh, name, but there's only one la lady there, and she's running the place all by herself, and she really can't, because she told us that everybody's gone off to war and left her there alone. And um, it um, looks like it's sort of a home away from home. There's beds you can sleep in and uh, stuff for the taking. It's a very interesting place. And a very interesting location down at the bottom of the uh, volcanic tundra uh, on the main road that runs along the west of the tundra, the west side of the tundra. The tundra has two roads, one that runs to the west of it, one that runs to the east of it. How many of these are there? Well, however many there were, they appear to be finished coming now. Okay, what is this? This is not, uh, looks like a person, but it's, <clears throat> okay, let's go. Wow. Something is really biting my nose today. Is that a... Yes, it is. Look at that. I always feel so fortunate when a, a vein shows up. A diamond. How about that? A diamond. Okay. Spider egg. Spider egg. I can't think of anything more naturally nasty than a spider egg. You ever seen little baby spiders? When a spider sack actually, you know, you, if you ever actually run across that in nature, it, it's like hundreds of little tiny they're almost microscopic and they just 
scatter and run everywhere. And it's, well, it's one of the creepiest things I've ever seen. And of course, they're so tiny, they couldn't hurt anything, except you know they're gonna grow up to be just like these things. Except, of course, they never grow up that big, of course. Except for those big black and yellow ones that that make the uh, gigantic webs. out on the porch that catch the dew in the morning. Of course, if you don't live in a part of the country that has dew in the morning, you wouldn't know what I'm talking about. I think that arrow just got stuck in the archery increased to 91. Wow. Whoa. Look at you. And there's another one. Good grief how many of these are there. I hear another one. There's a, what am I doing, falling? There's a mystery for you. How come sometimes things don't register? This place is just nasty. They have done such a good job. Kronvanger brood lair. Oh no, there's a nasty word. Brood lair. Oh, that just invokes all kinds of layers of nastiness. Okay. It's exactly where I want to go. are the noisiest things. How can a spider be noisy? I 
mean, I'm happy they're noisy, don't get me wrong. Well, hello there. Uh, knock you into last Thursday. Uh, what do we got here? Oh, we got a mama. Now I think you can see why. If you're serious about being an archer, which of course you can see that I am, then you need to be able to put arrows out there in a hurry. Moonstone, huh? Okay. Gold. Scroll of Conjure Storm Atronach. An Orcish Mace. I don't want Orcish Mace, for goodness sake. Let's um, I don't trust any place with spiders. There may still be more lurking. I don't know. I don't remember. Memory as you get older is an interesting thing. Still functions just fine. It just seems to be selective sometimes. As to what it decides to remember. When it remembers, it remembers just fine. Ninety two. Well, let's go see what. No, let's not. I have an idea. I have an idea. I don't think it's really. What kind of enemies? Well, it doesn't much matter, does it? Doesn't much matter. Because it could be much of in anything up on that tundra behind me. And there's not much use trying to figure out what it might be. Okay, you chickens continue to lay eggs there. And...
Let's see if that puts enough distance. Yes. Now the thought I had, and I don't believe this is true, but it's just one of those wild thoughts you have. That perhaps, whoops, well, if I'm here, I might as well clear up my inventory. Hmm? since I bothered to come all the way here. 38 creep clusters, okay, and 42 dragon stones. Those are the things, 44 jazz bay grapes. See, those are the things that you get exclusively in the volcanic tundra. those three items. And um, I didn't, I don't remember. Did I see any? Um, nope. Just that axe. Twenty one. Wow. A scroll. A single diamond and a circlet. And then a bunch of stuff to go in the box outside. external DVD burner is flashing a light at me. Wait a minute, stop making strips. Right, I was paying attention to the DVD burner and not what I was doing. Okay, corundum ore, iron ore, leather, leather strips, and moonstone ore. Ah, right, I got an axe, <laughs> axe, woodcutter's axe. So now the weight is 28. Scroll. Okay, the scroll is taking it up higher than it should be because that's only four, so it should only go to 27. But the scroll is kicked it up. Okay, all right. All right, okay. Was trouble in White Run, and I'll pull you into the Dragon's Reach dungeon myself. And I would let you, sir. I generally don't fight the law. It's, uh... It just winds up costing a lot of money.
Something has shifted in the moons, sister. You've got a sexy voice, Ella. You're someone who can get things done. I've cleared like the beast that. lair, Ella. Not bad. Not bad. The intensity of the hunt is special, isn't it? All right, then. Okay. Now, which one are you? Vilkas. Hey God, I wouldn't have expected someone like you oh, to be, be quiet. I'm looking for we work. We have a bit of a sensitive matter this time. Okay. A wealthy family has misplaced one Why of is that sensitive? I tell you, this province is losing its grip. The bandits become more brazen every day. I'll get it back. Move quickly, so we can have this over and done with. Be dead if not for Vignor. He took me in and helped me turn my life around. Retrieve the glass bow from Ember Shard. Oh, Ember Shard. Well, we know where that is. Sorry about that, my fair beauty. And I'm going to take all your stuff. And this tripwire down here, that's just one of my things. I try to go the entire game six, seven, eight hundred, nine hundred hours of playing the game without ever tripping that tripwire in Ember Shard. Not why is that up? Yeah, it's what I thought. We've been here. And this is just the second time, so therefore the the ore veins are not going to work. Oh, okay. That um, tone you heard was my um, DVD burner telling me that it's finished with its burn. And the drawer opened up and is staying open which is also the tip-off. <clears throat> okay, nobody's coming. So I've got to come hunt you guys down, okay? Usually, well, not usually. In the very first time you're at Ember Shard, they come running out to their death. There's a sack of gold up there, but I'll get it at some point. It doesn't respawn. You just get it once. At least that's my memory. Um... See the mushrooms respawn, but the uh, the veins don't.
There's another vein right there. It's not respawn. And another vein right there. Now let's get some target practice in. Not so much on this guy as on the other guys. Okay. There'll be a couple guys that'll eventually walk. There we go. That's satisfying. That is not an ore vein. <laughs> Whoops. I forgot. I knocked them off of there. They're down here. They're not up here. They're down here in the water. Hello, guys. Gals, excuse me. Guys and gals. Another vein. And the last vein in Ember Shard is there. But I actually like to think that there are two more because you come out here, bear left a little bit, and you'll find two more out here. And since they're not in the side and are not governed by the rules such as they are I suppose of the <coughs> of the inside they're outside there and this is a tricky one uh, where is it where is it come on come on there we go oh great yeah, yeah, I see it. I might have lost that vein probably. 
unless I stand still, I'll probably... Got a hit in. Got two hits in. No sense in trying to get back to that vein. I could look for a very long time and not find it. Thank you, Arvac. Appreciate it. Okay, and we have a circlet, and that's it. And that'll mark the end of this session. Twenty-seven.
Yep, that's it, because we have the witch's head, so we have a new... fighting weight. I guess we might as well go on to Kronvang, uh, not Kronvanger, might as well go on to uh, Jorvasker uh, before we stop, get the fast travel over with. And then we can uh, Side. There we go. And that's it. See you next time.